What's good? It's your boy T-R-E-N-T, -E and I'm back one more again. This time I'm back with my brand new segment called First Time Hearing, where I'm digging in the crates, finding old songs or new songs that I never heard. And unlike the other YouTubers and reactors, I'm not going to skip the songs. I'm not going to pause the songs. I listen to the whole song, and at the end, I get my commentary. I grade each song from 0 to 10, 10 being the best. So if it's a trash song, y'all already know that's 5 and below. If it's me, average, okay, that's a six. Now, if it's a good song, depending on how good I think it is, and y'all, that's seven to ten. So make sure y'all stay tuned to the end of each video so y'all can give y'all grade. And make sure y'all subscribe. And um, when we get the 10K subs, there will be a cash app giveaway after every reaction. So after every one of these reactions, you could be the winner. So make sure y'all follow me on every social media. Look, Trent Music is spelled the same way as this channel. So for right now, this is first time here. Fucking panties on and going to make a reaction bitch. <laughs> I hate you niggas that make reaction bits. This is my first time hearing Patsy Klein crazy. Now I'm watching the video, but I'm reacting to the music, so stay to the end. first time reacting to Patsy Klein song crazy first of all um before I get my grade on this song in particular I just want to talk about this was probably way before like probably before the 50s it was in shot in black and white the video and I like shout out to everybody who make timepiece um, documentaries and movies and whatnot but the industry the music industry that is they need to tell these stories. Like, I know the superhero genre of movies took over the last years in the millennium. But, man, bro, I grew up on um, watching The Temptations and The Five Heartbeats, even though I had to grow up and find out The Five Heartbeats wasn't a real group. But it gets kids and, like, people want to know about the artists that we don't know about. And I feel like the music industry, if y'all want to make little extra money, put out some digging y'all crates like I'm digging in the crates and 
like tell their story like who do you, i know they got some crazy stories especially back then you know what i'm saying like we just recently um lost quincy jones and not only that's just a loss to his family and to the world just like you gotta think about quincy jones was around the ray charles days the little richard days all the way to the michael jackson days even the fresh prince a bet like he touched culture in so many ways you got to think about so many people's stories need to be told regardless if we know them or don't know them you know what i'm saying and of course they black or white this a white lady i never heard but i bet she got a crazy story speaking of the song crazy it the song crazy definitely dope it's a good song like it's beautifully sung it, it had me watching her like if she was singing live, I'd be all eyes on deck. This back when, in the days when somebody performing, you all eyes anyway, just watching, not on your phone and on social media like nowadays. But she got a beautiful voice. I have to get this song a nine just based on if I was born back then and this song came out, would I buy it? Yes, I would buy it. That's kind of like similar to me adding it to my playlist today. No, I won't add it to my playlist today, but it make me curious about who is Batsy Klein. If y'all got some Batsy Klein music y'all want me to react to, let me know in the comments. Make sure y'all subscribe and don't forget to leave y'all grade. I gave it a nine. What do y'all give it? And we're going to catch a vibe on Twitch after this. But for right now, we're about to catch some more vibes. First time hearing. Click the next video if you rocking out. If not, ah.